Way back in the year 2022, I made a video showing step-by-step -step how to unlock a Boofwang UV5R handheld HT walkie-talkie hams radios. So far, almost a million people have watched that video, and thousands of people have left comments thanking me for helping to vastly improve their lives and their personal relationships by guiding them through how to unlock their radio. But sadly, thousands of other people have also left comments on that same video complaining that they were not able to unlock their Bufuang UV5R hams radios. And even thousands more left comments angrily whining and griping because they thought, incorrectly, that unlocking their radio is going to do something other than what actually happens when you unlock a radio. So in this video, I am going to very clearly explain three things. Number A, what does unlocking a Bufuang UV5R mean and what is it supposed to do? And number two, the reasons why you may not have been able to unlock your UV5R radio. First of all, the most common reason people were not able to unlock their Bufuang UV5R radio is because they did it wrong. So watch that video again. I will put a link to that video in the more information section of this video below. But this time when you watch it, try to pay attention and then try to unlock your radio again. The other reason you may not be able to unlock your UV5R radio is because your radio was already unlocked. In other words, you cannot unlock a radio that is not locked. This is because pretty much all UV5R radios manufactured from the time they first started making them, way back in 2002 or so, up until around 2021, are unlocked. So there is no need to unlock it. And if you try to unlock it following the steps in that video, nothing will happen because it's already unlocked. UV5R radios manufactured from around 2021 or so to around 2023 or so, give or take, are locked and can be unlocked by following the simple steps in that other video. UV5R radios manufactured starting sometime around 2023-ish or so up until today are locked and cannot be unlocked if it was made for sale in these once great again United States. If you got lucky and got one of these newer radios that was supposed to be shipped to Pakistan or something like that, it is probably not locked at all or it can be unlocked. And finally, another very common reason why you could not unlock your UV5R by following the steps in that other video is because your radio is not a UV5R. In that video, I was very clear that the specific four finger gymnastics required to unlock a UV5R radio only works on a UV5R radio. It might work on some other Bufuang radio models, but unless your radio says specifically on the sticker UV5R, not UV5RH, not UV5RM, if it does not say UV5R, it probably will not work. So what does an unlocked radio do, and what is the difference between a locked radio and an unlocked radio, you may ask? Most hams radios, like the Bufuang UV5R, are locked in, or only able to transmit on the hams radio's frequencies. Unlocking the radio will allow it to transmit on way more frequencies, such as GMRS or MERS frequencies, private business frequencies, and even NOAA weather channels, should you choose to do so but I do not advise it. However, an unlocked UV5R is still limited by the physical limitations of what the radio guts are capable of doing. An unlocked UV5R still cannot transmit on anything below around 136 my gigahertz or so, or above around 500 my gigahertz. For example, an unlocked UV5R cannot transmit on the United States CB radio channels or on airplane frequencies, because those are outside of the range of what the radio is physically capable of doing. Likewise, unlocking a UV5R does not change what frequencies the radio can receive. All Bufuang UV5R radios can already receive way more stuff than they can transmit on. And unlocking it will not change that one bit. And that is all that unlocking it will do. It will not 
change how many fars the radio can give. It's not going to change the color of the screen or the sound that the Roger Beep makes. Unlocking only allows the radio to transmit on a wider but not unlimited range of frequencies. And if you thought otherwise, then you were wrong.